Good morning, everyone. I am in southern Utah, in around the Grand Staircase Escalante area. Um, I believe the hike I'm doing right now is Bighorn Canyon. We'll see how it is. Um, it's currently 6.30 on the dot. Um, I forgot my tripod, which I'm so upset about because I'm going in slot canyons and I really wanted some cool photos, but this will make me enjoy being more in the present moment, which is good. Um, of course, I'm still going to try and take some photos, but we'll see how it goes. Um, there's also a coffee shop that's in, like, back, not in this specific area, but, like, just down the road. And it has, like, a really cool, like, scenic overlook. Um, and they're only open Wednesday through Sunday, 8 to 4 p.m. So, I'm going to try and go there today. Um, so, we'll see how that goes. There are, that also, since I forgot my tripod, that also means that there's not going to be a ton of filming, but we'll see. Lonely times, lonely places have seen my teardrops fall. Lonely heart, lonely places that stare at lonely walls. But with all these tears and heartaches, dear, I still have sweet dreams of you. And time has gone by. Tell myself that one of these days you'll come back home to me and you'll be my love once again. But I know that it's all just fantasy, that it's just some little game I've been playing because I thousand years when all of this is gone we'll come back as something new if you are a stone in a valley of green I will be a river to come meet you but for now I'll sit with my memory of a love of that I once knew
Good morning. I haven't really recorded all that much on this trip. And I'm kind of thankful for it. Um, I forgot my tripod, so it's really hard to get video clips of myself when I'm by myself without one because I don't want to set my camera in really fine sand. Um, it'll just wreck the camera and I already dropped it in the sand. Um, so I don't want to do that, but it's actually been super nice to not have almost the pressure to get a million clips and photos and all that. Um, which no one is making me do those things in the first place. I am putting that pressure on myself. Um, but I do, I really enjoy taking photos and getting video clips and all that fun stuff. Um, but I think sometimes I go overboard with it and think that I need to get a photo at every cool place that I go to. Um, so it was nice to not have that feeling because I couldn't in a lot of places, so I just took photos of the landscape, which is nice. It's also been so helpful that I haven't had service during this time, um, most of this time at least, because then I can't just scroll on TikTok and Instagram and whatever else. I can actually go and enjoy where I'm at without really any distractions. One thing I'm really bummed about is that I couldn't make it down the hole in the rock road all the way. I had started driving down this road around 7.30 p.m. and I drove until 10.30 and I physically could not drive anymore and so I laid in the back for a second but the wind was so insane that I just like couldn't stay there and it also started raining and there was a sign at the beginning of the road that said may be impassable when raining um or if it has rained and I am by myself and on this remote road and I just didn't want to chance it so I got out from the back um grabbed some popcorn and drove all the way back to the main road it is a washboard road and so you have to go 10 miles an hour and so it's only three it's only 30 miles but it's at 10 miles an hour so it takes forever um and since it was starting like since it was storming now it was pretty sketchy and I was so tired but I couldn't stay there because it was unsafe and I'm actually, I'm really bummed that I didn't get to do the hikes that I wanted to down there. It was really nice to not have the pressure to go, go, go. Because I tend to do that when I go on these trips is I want to do as much as I possibly can and don't actually rest. I am so glad that I was able to then yesterday have a slow morning, made breakfast, and then later went on a hike and it turned out to be really cool. I got to see I got to see Natural Bridge in Escalante and I am so glad that I was able to do that. I wouldn't have done that otherwise. And then the rest of the day I went to a coffee shop and had pizza, which I'm probably going to have for breakfast. And it started storming really badly. And the lightning and thunder were just right over our heads. So I'm re I'm very glad that I did the hike when I did it. And also I was able to be inside and out of my car during that time. I waited out most of the storm there. So I wasn't really in any danger, which is nice. Uh, but if had I been on that sketchy road... I could have been stuck there due to a flash flood because there's a flash flood warning and definitely not allowed to be in the slot canyons that I wanted to be in. Flash floods are 
crazy and they could happen so quickly if there's a rain if there's rain in any area around you it could happen so uh in the forecast it did not say that it was going to storm or rain or anything like this so I wouldn't have known and I don't have service down that road so it was a really good thing that I actually turned around and didn't get to do what I wanted to do I hope you enjoyed this video um I had a great time Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.